Oh, you got a baby approaching you. Whoa, somebody got scared. Who was that? Hey, we're Michael and Abby. Welcome back to another travel vlog. In this series, we're on a mission to discover just how spectacular the fall colors are in Colorado. We'll be road tripping through some of the state's most scenic spots, capturing the essence of a Colorado fall. In the last vlog, we were in Rocky Mountain National Park. And in this video, we are heading all the way home, but not before stopping to see a little slice of heaven on earth. I love him so much. Good morning. We are in Longmont right now. And uh, we didn't end the vlog last night. Dinner was very good, by the way. Very good. Yeah. 10 out of 10, recommend for sure. But we are at Dutch Brothers right now. Hitting it up or for one last time. One last time in Colorado. Dutch Bros coffee. Getting the cold brew again. What are you getting? Uh, I think I got the Americano, which was really, really good. Hi. Hello. Hello. So we got you guys your large cold brew and your large hot Americano. Uh -huh. Do we want a straw? Um, yeah, one well, for the iced coffee. Yes. Yeah. Do you guys have stickers? Yes. Can I have a sticker, please? Totally, totally. Who's on your shirt? I'm trying to see. Alan Jackson. Hey, nice. We <laughs> love him. Here's some stickers. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, of course, guys. All right, have a good day. Thank you too. We'll see you later. See ya. Same. Look at that. Dutch Bros coming through. Yep. Dutch Bros coming through. So we haven't even really told you, I don't think, what we're doing today. Probably, I, we're trying to think about it, probably the past two years we followed Long Hope's uh, donkey, is it a rescue? They're close to where we stayed last night, so we are going to go see some donkeys today. Welcome to our weight loss program. <laughs> you can go hiking, you can take them with them. If you go camping, they can go with you. You know, kind of like you take your dogs, people take their donkeys and do that. Yeah. So they yeah. So, um, so every wild animal has the potential to become this. Um, and that's, <laughs> oh, she'll love that. Yeah. And that's because they've been domesticated for over 2,000 years, which means they do want to be around humans. Um, Susie and Sandy uh, have had those names for their entire life, 16 years. So they do know their names. They're very much like cats, though. They only reply if they want. Somebody's trying to fight for your affection. <laughs> Never mind, I'm a liar. Marshall and beans. Right? 
And they take a nap It's only like they sleep two hours And then we got They just take like a 20 minute nap yeah. oh, And then they night time But technically mm -hmm. they're here For a very very long time So if they don't have anything to do If they don't have toys If you don't train out You don't walk out for a walk mm -hmm. They figure out how to get out of here because <laughs> that's all they're doing. Do they have certain times of the day where they're doing all of that? And yeah, so we train them. We teach them how to talk to other donkeys. Look at Gladys' camera. Hello. Oh, what did they say? Gladys is 37? Yeah. Oh, Gladys. She's pushing me behind. And Ooh. back of the pack here and they keep <laughs> they're all following us That just have a harder time with the flies and when we notice that we just this is the baby that was born in the winter <laughs> i don't know they these guys once you give them a tree they won't do anything without it oh my god oh my god oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> give me a shake 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 i'll take it away from you Oh! <laughs> that was well, that one was forced. We do. That's great. That is really, really good. <laughs> oh, you got a baby approaching you. Whoa, somebody got scared. Who is that? Is there a dog or something? No. Hi. I love him so much. Hi. Hi. A little. Hi. <laughs> it's like it's coming out of his ass, but then it's like also coming out of the ass of the ass. I wonder if there's the baby. It's four months old. I know. Yes. He is so cute. Yes. It feels good, doesn't it? Look at all the minis right here. Oh, yeah. Right here. <laughs> oh, Gavin is falling asleep. Do you see that? So I got the brush sly right there. She said no one has ever been able to brush him. He might be an Alan Jackson fan, but he also, I might be a donkey whisperer. I yeah, she said that was the first time ever that anyone was able to do that. Aww. Feels so special. Hey, look you, at them all coming now. Have a kind heart. Oh, hello. Do you want, do you want brushed? So that was our time at Long Hoops. Um, they do great things with donkeys right here. So I will leave all the information, um, the Airbnb to book a tour with them. I'll leave all their socials and everything. You we can had see a little Tanzania. Tanzania. We had such a good time here today. Arnie. And as you can see, we're swimming in a sea of donkeys. This is what heaven is like. 
But yeah, that is pretty much it for the trip. So we are ending this vlog pretty much in a sea of donkeys. But thanks for watching. Hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe, and we will see you on the next one. <laughs> hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. We'd really appreciate if you hit that like and subscribe if you haven't already. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram and TikTok. And we will see you on the next video.